Hi, my name is Brett Harvey, and in this video, I'm going to show you our new product called the Stay Pal. Now, the Stay Pal is primarily used by electricians or do it yourself home renovators when doing electrical in their own house. Now, the Stay Pal was made so that you never have to worry about hitting your fingers again when hammering in electrical staples because this allows your hand to be nowhere near the staple when you're installing it. Now the Stay Pal is made with a cross in the face so that you can put electrical staples either horizontally into the face or you can put them in vertically. And there's, an, there's a magnet in the center of the Stay Pal so that the staple when put into place will never fall out. Now notice when I'm lining up to install the electrical staple, my hand is nowhere near the wire or the electrical staple and all it takes to install it is two swings of the hammer and it's in. Now, because it's so easy and it's so fast to install electrical staples, you're gonna save a lot of time on a job and a lot of money. Now the, the Staypal will also accommodate S2 staples. S2 staples are used for three wire electrical wire and they go in much the same. Now, the Stay Pal not only is used for installing electrical staples, but also it is used for removing electrical staples, whether either using the tip or using the claws of the Stay Pal. Electrical staples come out easier than ever. You can either use the claws, like so, or the other side, or you can use the tip. The Stay Pal is the best tool out on the market right now for pulling out electrical staples in any situation. Here's an example of trying to staple an electrical wire in a tight space. This could be in between two doors or a door and a window where I have a light switch and I don't have enough room to actually staple onto the side. So what I can do is instead of trying to get my hand in there, which I can't, I can use a Stay Pal and install an electrical staple in a tight space which I couldn't before and not only can I put them to put the staples in they also come out just as easy the staple gives you that extra little bit of reach you need to get that last staple in you can staple into OSB floor joists that you normally wouldn't and here's a video of me taking a staple out completely blind Number nine. From framing to decking to remodeling, great pros do it all. We believe your AutoFeed screw system should too. Presenting PamFast from Fastamaster. PamFast is a versatile system designed to drive screws everywhere you do. Whether your job is inside or out, PamFast has a fastener specific to the task, including subfloors, drywall, cement board, pressure treated decking, or composite decking, PamFast does it all. The secret is the smooth advancement technology exclusive to the PamFast tool. It effortlessly advances the next screw on the downstroke, eliminating jams and misfeeds. Combined with a Pam Max fastener belt, which holds 40% more fasteners, PamFast is engineered with speed in mind. Fastmaster has been a leader in fastener innovation for almost 30 years. We've brought that same knowledge and expertise to the PamFast system. The proprietary Pam Drive six lobe drive system is engineered to have 12 points of contact for virtually zero cam outs and an extended bit life. Every PamFast tool is easily converted from a long stand up tool, great for flooring and decking, to a shorter handheld tool perfect for drywall and roof tiles. This conversion takes less than a minute with no special tools required. Adjusting the depth and changing the bits is just as easy. Simply adjust the nose piece to the proper length 
then use the precision countersink dial to bring it perfectly flush within a 64th of an inch. So stop the slow and painful process of installing one screw at a time. The PamFast AutoFeed Screw System is a whole home fastening solution that installs screws everywhere you do. Available in three motor options, cordless Makita and DeWalt, plus a corded Milwaukee. To learn more and get an on-site demonstration, visit us at FastenMaster.com. Number eight. This is the underground roof drain for the barn. This is the new uh, bevel box by Reed Manufacturing. This is the old four inch grinder that we used to use for beveling along with the quickie saw, which is pretty big and bulky. Normally they just bevel it with the side of the blade on that. I would say the bevel boss has cut that time in, in half or better. Our main interest is the time savings and the, the ease of beveling you know, on our downspout operation when we're you know, building these houses. It takes so much less time to use that bevel boss and we're putting so many fittings together that we need it about every 10 minutes. And it's just a whole lot easier. The type of pipe we normally use is SDR 35. Anything from four to eight inch, four, six, and eight. Uh, majority of it is four inch and six inch. Turn it, slide it all the way up. That would be for your four inch. And we have found that about a quarter inch from the bottom works best for six inch SDR 35. I feel this is much safer. So with lightweight, smaller size, and you just have to go around six inches versus manhandling that quickie saw all the way around your six inch pipe. After using it, yes, I would recommend it to anybody. Number seven. Number six. Weha's color-coded magnetic nut setters are designed with high visibility color coding and size callouts for quick and easy identification. A robust design for long-lasting repetitive use, industrial strength magnets for one-handed applications, and impact rated for power tools to withstand the most challenging jobs. The six-piece color-coded nut setters are available in popular sizes and are backed by Weha's no hassle guarantee. Number five. Introducing the Worth Nut Buddy. The Worth Nut Buddy is used to bust loose the most stubborn wheel nuts. It can be used on commercial or agricultural wheels. It has a gear ratio of 58 to 1 with a rated output torque of 2,950 foot-pounds. It comes with two sockets included, a 1.5 inch 38 millimeter and a 1 5 16th inch 33 millimeter one inch drive socket. As you can see, this lug nut has been over torqued. The torque gun cannot loosen it. The Worth Nut Buddy is designed to take off stubborn 
next to impossible lug nuts with ease. The Worth Nut Buddy comes in a convenient carrying case. The case contains two one inch drive sockets, a 33 millimeter and a 38 millimeter. Simply put the appropriate socket on the lug nut, then put the Worth Nut Buddy tool on the socket with the arm resting on the closest lug nut for support. Put the handle on the Worth Nut Buddy and turn until the lug nut loosens. Once the lug nut has been loosened, take the extension and put the handle on one end and the extension into the socket and twirl the loose lug nut until it is off. Repeat on any other lug nuts that need to be loosened. The Worth Nut Buddy eliminates the need to replace the studs. Number three.